שלום ברכם, אשר בי ריוויו, אשר בליס יו, לייף איז אדרים, הוא אדרים, עוד אדם אדרים, to be rich, אדרים, to have a good mazal, אדרים, 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 it's a dream. Sometimes there is real dreams that a man can dream when he sleep. My friend, and uh, I was given, just today I heard a beautiful story. I was given a shiur in Paris, and after the shiur people come for a bracha. There was two girls, friends. I give them a bracha, I give them good health, and a good mazah to get married. Okay, that's what I do, that's what I say to everyone. But the one I told her, I pray for you to be well, healthy. She asked her friend, what do you think, I'm not well? No, Rabbi David said that to everyone. To everyone. But she was not, a, a, she was not well. Uh, she was not comfort. So she went to the doctor. This, this, this morning, I heard this story. This morning. She went to the doctor. And the doctor told her, uh, well, do this check, pa, 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 some examination. And after a while, he told her, well, you are lucky. You have uh, the machala. You have uh, the bad illness. So you, you need a big, big, big treatment. I don't know how you, how you find out this, but uh, okay. And uh, that lady, at, she came to see me at the time. And I gave her the bracha. I told her, please, Be'ez Hashem, come to see me when you are well. 18 years later, Last February, she came to see me with a big envelope. She told me, Baruch Hashem, I am now uh, well, after 18 years, now I want to get married. I told her, you know, this money that you want to give me now, I will give it to a couple that you want to get married. And please, this year, give me good news that you will get married. She told me, Rabbi David, my friend, that, that you blessed, she's married. And me, I was ill. Now I want to get married, like my friend, and to have children. I said, Be'ezat Hashem, the same way that Hashem is sent you, Refu Hashem, Hashem will give you health. And Baruch Hashem, I just, we see the good news this morning, Baruch Hashem, that she's going to get married before Rosh Hashanah. Ha! Imuna. Imuna, I mean, look, the students, they were not supposed to come to the, to the lecture, and they came. One should receive a bracha to get married, the other one should receive a bracha uh, to be healthy. This is normal, that's what I say to everyone. But in her, in her brain, what he said? So, he said, no, she wanted a doctor. And then she found out that she was not right. Today we have no prophets. What? No prophets. The day Hashem, he sent a message. Like I was receiving people, and I heard some ladies that they were waiting outside, talking about going to a trip. So when they came, I told them, don't, don't travel. But we have tickets, we have, uh, we have to... No, I said, uh, no, this week, this week, uh, go. So they listened to me. And Baruch Hashem, that they did not travel. Why? Because the day that they were supposed to take the plane, the husband had a heart attack. Imagine. If he wasn't the plane, he'd pass away. I mean, I mean, it's incredible, incredible. I mean, I was not supposed to listen to this conversation. So even if I listen, so let them travel. No, I said to myself, if I heard this conversation, that means 
maybe it, maybe it's better not to travel. No question. And then we shine in the Arab. Only when you have Imuna and you rely on Hashem, so Hashem has ways how to help you. Hashem, yes.